Well, and as the electricity company of Ghana is demanding a 148% increment in tariffs, Executive Director of ASAP Ben Bwache says any further subsidy could crumble Ghana's already fragile economy. Yes, if your energy prices is going to go up, um, every segment of the value chain in, in, in energy has to go up. And to the extent that, you know, um, street lights consume power, it, that tariff cannot stay the same. But to what extent? I think on Wednesday, there will be a discussion where we would have to interrogate uh, the numbers that ECG will pre present. And they will have to show clearly how they will reduce the waste and inefficiencies uh, for us to continue to pay uh, the tariff that they always want to push on the consumer. If you do not reduce the inefficiencies, the tendency is that people will still have room uh, to steal power. So what are you going to do is to pile the burden on the few honest, legitimate uh, uh, customers that you do have. And many people, many businesses still continue to steal power uh, and not pay for it. So those are significant questions that we want ECG to address uh, when we meet uh, PRC and the stakeholders on Wednesday. And that's all in for business for now. My name is Daryl Kwal. Thanks for watching.